Hello students! Today we're going to learn how to tell time. Now for telling time, you use the time expression in minutes. In minutes. The word pass goes after the hour and the word to goes before the hour. Okay? So to say that it is exactly six, that it is six, we say six o'clock. Six o'clock. Now to say that ten minutes, ten minutes have passed since it was six, we say ten past six. Ten past six. Okay? And to say that we are missing ten minutes for it to be six, ten minutes for it to be six, we say ten to six. Ten to six. So this is... Let's look at some other examples. Here are some more examples of how to tell time. So to say 6.10, we would say it's 10 minutes past 6, past 6. To say 10.20, we would say it's 10 minutes past 10, past 10. Now to say it's 2.15, there are two different ways. We can say it's 15 minutes past 2. It's 15 minutes past 2. Or we can say it's quarter past 7. It's quarter past 7. We use quarter to symbolize that it's this piece of four piece of the clock. Okay? So it is quarter past 7. Now for 11.30 or 4.30, there are also two ways. We can say... It's half past 11, it's half past 11, or it's 4.30. It's 4.30. Now half, half means it is half the clock, okay? So it is one half. And it's 4.30, it's just that it's 30 minutes after 4, okay? Now for 8.40, we would say it's 20 minutes to 9. It's 20 minutes to 9. For 3.55, we would say it's 5 minutes to 4. It's 5 minutes to 4. And for 1.45 or 5.45, we also have two different ways. We can say it's 15 minutes to 2 or it's quarter to 6. It's quarter to six. Okay. Thank you for listening.